Hi guys. In this tutorial we are going to uh, create um, some kind of conceptual three wheels bicycle. You can, um, uh, after we finish, you can download this uh, file from my grab uh, cut profile, uh, which is just listed on the screen. And uh, of course you can go to my Facebook fan page and like my profile, so you're gonna uh, get some very interesting interesting information about new technologies of Rhino, uh, new tutorials, uh, uh, anything which might be helpful in uh, in the learning uh, to the Rhino. Let's let's start. Uh, usually, I'm starting my idea my ideas from uh, profile curves. It helps me to uh, it helps me to uh, make a very interesting shapes. So now I'm creating the uh, two uh, arches, uh, which will actually be uh, uh, profiles of my of my uh, idea. So another arch going goes here, like like so. And I'm going to rebuild these arches by putting the uh, points like that and I'm going to use sweep two rails comment to build a first uh, surface and I'm going to uh, I'm going uh, to uh, straight to mm, to copy that profile uh, from the fr from the basically front view because I've set the front view on the right view on the front view but it doesn't matter especially so just make a mirror uh, let's just get the zero point to, to, to be the mirror and I'm going to move this like that and I'm going to take those uh, profiles control C control a V and then just rotate 90 degrees like that Mm. and then I'm going to get those shapes and I'm going to rotate them like that so uh, this is going to be a very simple concept but it mm, doesn't matter you can actually build it as you want uh, in the future so now actually all I can do I can uh, turn the control points of these surfaces as you can see right now go to uh, to the view to the side view and then select select points you want to uh, adjust a little bit so as you can see I can scale it a little bit yeah like that yeah this is gonna be my shape so I will just unselect that uh, I'm going to unselect those points and then make some some another adjustment with those points like that okay it's far enough uh, so I'm going to turn the control points off I can actually do the same thing in front of my a bicycle three wheels bicycle so I'm going to scale those points to like like that okay it's it's kind of enough and um, I'm going to make mm, another arch from side view like that it is the, this this uh, car will help me to create a, another profile let's create some arch from top view something is wrong here is everything is okay and um, I'm going to create that profile and I'm, I need to put this carve I've made it in a 90 degrees like that and then I'm going to place it at the end of that curve by using the move command and now I'm going to sweep I'm going to sweep one rail, rail and, and the profile. Okay, 
and basically I can do the same thing but I, uh, if you spot a duck kind of kind of lots of points I can rebuild <coughs> rebuild that surface by decreasing amount of point rebuild this uh, here uh, you see I can just make a five uh, three you see there's uh, much much less points it will help me to adjust my curve as I want uh, you can make it a more morphic or or smoother as you as you want I'm quite happy with this and also I can actually grasp those points and make some adjustments like that yeah and uh, I will just grab that surface and pull a little bit towards the back of my machine I can now scale it and I will just try to uh, copy that surface somewhere here like that and then going to cross that with those with this shape maybe rotate a little bit like that yeah that should do the job okay so now basically I need to um, find the comment which will help me to get those uh, uh, surfaces and make uh, make the solid out of it which is uh, the special comment called create solid I'm just selecting those curves uh, those surfaces and making making the profile making 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 the solid okay now I need to I uh, make a little bit of uh, filleting um, uh, here I will put some great nice smooth fillet here which is gonna be like 15 it's too big so it's gonna be six it's, it's all right like that and uh, I'm going to create the same thing the same thing here okay and I can do so much smaller there it's too big one that's cool and uh, all I need to do right now well uh, we need to be more precise so I will just get my last uh, changes I will just make this one two this one two and I'm going to do <coughs> five here let's see how it how it's going to work this doesn't work uh, so let's try to decrease our amount of the, the profiles so let's be five here five here and one here yeah that's 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 kind of cool I'm quite happy with it all right so now we need to just make um, uh, the wheels so I'll just go on, f on the back of my um, of my ve vehicle and then I um, will try to create a cylinder and I'll create the cylinder like that okay just a small you can adjust it later it doesn't doesn't make a big problem if it's too big you can just adjust and just make some adjustment right now uh, all I need to is just to be a uh, curve uh, just to be bent uh, angled uh, here mm, so I'm going to move it back like that I'm going to I need to place a front wheel somewhere let's just just create a front wheel like that let's see you have to remember this is just conceptual work so we're not going to be very very advanced with this with this designing it just give you a rough idea how how you can f uh, make a, make a 
flow of this design in your way okay and uh, I'm going to fillet one is too, one millimeter is too big so it's gonna be 0.5 let's let's say it's tire we need to center that okay there is no center here it's here okay let's just make a blocked uh, aligning okay and then I'm going to create I need to be uh, the same here so I'm going to make a I'm going to make a fillet here uh, let's just play a little bit more with this uh, tire so I'm going to hide that one and I'm going to <coughs> uh, actually build a new one here because I don't like this shape it looks too terrible I'm going to make that shape I'm going to copy that shape mirror by using mirror somewhere here and I'm going to make a uh, blend here which is gonna be tangency that will do the job okay and the same here okay now I'm going to uh, join it and then probably you guess I'm going to revolve it revolve and uh, find the center of it and then full circle okay now it's much better and uh, okay that's that's great and uh, all I need to do right now I need to align that because it might it, it have to be on the floor it have to like a uh, drive on the floor so I need to uh, uh, I need to just uh, rotate that according to that point towards an angle towards the shape of all that idea so this is gonna be the concept of that uh, uh, that bicycle with the mm, rotated with the uh, curvy uh, wheels but I'm as I said I'm one I want to make a little bit of a cool design here so I will just make a arch here I like that maybe more like this well you can do anything you like but I'm trying to find this some some great solution for the uh, nice and cool design uh, of uh, of the wheel mm hmm okay I know what to do I will just go and get that idea split that shape uh, yeah, a little bit bigger I'm going to split that shape hmm? uh, what's happened uh, split is here yeah it's already split it so now it's uh, kind of uh, wheel I'm going to use this as a uh, as a rim so I'll make a copy of that and I'm going to make a offset like that and then I'll try to I'll try to uh, I'll try to erase that edge like that and then move it a little bit towards me in the center of the of that and then just make a blend it can be uh, can be just uh, 
uh, can be just normal uh, normal position blend which you see right now it's gonna be like a chamfer you can make a fillet if you want but I'm, I'm, I'm right with uh, with the chamfer and now I'm going to uh, I'll try to do some uh, basically I can delete that and copy that on the opposite of my on the opposite side of my design I like that it's gonna look so great right now and then I'm going to mm, I'm going to use some kind of uh, shape to create like a great rim concept I will uh, use that so let's just make a revolve not revolve sorry um, polar array well just I'll just make first the shape yeah so offset that inside it's gonna be three I'm going to project this on the rim like that and then I'm I need to I need to just make a mm, polar array oh, let's check five if five is okay it's too big so it's too it's too much it's just going to be free it's all right and then i'm going to use it to cut uh, the middle like that okay and then i'm going to grab that shape stand and then put it a little bit towards to the middle okay and then I'm going to do the same which is blend so this is just a playing with the shape okay so now I can basically join that <coughs> and then let's go back to my uh, to my design to my shape the body body design and now I'm going to I'm going to rotate that maybe that's enough I need to change the alignment of uh, gamble it will help me to be uh, parallel to the axis okay mm. right and now I need to like make a bridge be between those two so this is kind of uh, fun it uh, right now so let's just uh, let's just hide that let's just hide all of the shapes I've got it I'll just put it into the another layer and uh, switch it off and I'm going to make some uh, ellipse right now let's let, let it just be something maybe not that big that should do the job I'm going to place it somewhere maybe scale it a little bit like that here okay and I'm going to actually cut it all all of it through my design and let's, let's turn uh, my my wheels back and I'm going to do the same with my wheels but okay but with different uh, ellipse so let's just make ellipse like that and then move it somewhere in the in the here okay and I need to project that on my wheel okay 
right I don't need this one so this this profile because this projection I just need that project I have to hide that and then I'll try to make a hole inside like that that's great and try to make a bridge between those two shapes it might look great but might not but who knows let's try to make a blend arrows must be in a one direction so we have to we have to flip it okay and now yeah now it's something went wrong so we have to go back sometimes the the surface twisting directions so let's go here let's play a little bit with arrows Yeah, now it's much better, but it's with it's, it's just with no tangency. I can apply some tangency. It's uh, too big, so we can uh, decrease the amount of it. It's still too big, and it's not nice. I uh, can now make a just a simple arch between those two shapes, so it will help me to control that. And the same here. I like that. It's great. And let's try to make uh, instead of doing them uh, blend. It's try. Let's try to make sweep two rails. One, two, one, two. No, it's not bad. It's actually great. Okay. I could have done some uh, some bigger uh, ellipse here to make it to make it much uh, the, the connection between those two shapes much bigger, but it doesn't matter. Actually, I can now try to connect those by just uh, well. Let's first connect those two. Let's go uh, mirror that. okay and then we need to uh we need to make a hole inside of this shape so i need to basically look inside so look go inside i ah, already sorry it's already been done so i just need to make join between those and those and it's joined and now i can actually apply some chamfer between those shapes i hope it will work sometimes it's it's really hard to get this it's just five well, okay it's right let's check it out it's not bad it's not bad I can make a, a try, try to make a bigger one my looks much better let's make one <coughs> it's not exactly what I'm what I was going to do uh but we can try go back to the previous version which is 1.5 and then see how it looks yeah this is this is actually what 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 la what fits the shape great All right, it's not bad. And the same, actually, we could we could do here, and take a look how it go. It's too big, so we have to decrease the size of of chamfer. So now it's point one. It should do. It look, looks great. The details makes it makes it real nice in the renders. If you if you're planning to do some so. It's okay. And uh, mm, let's try to make a kind of cabin here. Let's go on a side view, and I'm going to make a. 
like cabin like that okay and we going to split this shape um, let's split that shape uh, split is here cutting objects yeah and uh, now I'm going to make a offset of that curve let's be three not too big one point five okay and now I'm going to cut that idea here and basically I will just try to I'll try to scale that I mean maybe it would be better to offset that shape inside so it's gonna be like a 0.3 not solid no and delete that it's great looks fantastic so now I'm going to do the blend uh, let's remember to be auto chain uh, and then the same here so two auto chains applied auto chain here yes and auto chain here yes ah, okay I see the problem I would like to be uh, uh, to cut that into the nice shape because this is just uh, offset offset makes it really bad sometimes so we need to make the trimming again and now it's gonna be great so let's try to make yeah next segment is all right and uh, I love position positioning right now to be very like a cosmic okay so this is basically this is basically it let's say this is really creepy it looks now especially especially uh, next to that shape so let's go back and correct that so I will fix the ground here and we are going to delete that and then arch again uh, one okay and then mirror it's a little bit too big so I need to uh, make them closer then mirror again and that's better and then try to uh, make a bridge which is blend and and put them first join them and align them with the ground shift tab to, to be precise and uh, and uh, orthogonal and now I need to revolve as you can see you can easily use a uh, typing to call the comments yeah now now it's much much better and uh, well if you don't like the size you can try to make it a little bit bigger and of course what I need to what I need to do right now it's a small uh, adjustment of the shape so let's just hide that and let's make some cool design so I need to I need to split that shape with, with, uh, split that shape sorry uh, split and now I'm going to use this edge I'll uh, duplicate that and then I didn't do it actually because that's you have to confirm like that and join and straight I'm going to make a straight on I'm going to make an offset so it's gonna be like that it's all right and let's check it out what what it's going to go at the end okay so I'm going to make those two closer inside like that I need to delete that one because it 
doesn't I doesn't know where is specific place according to the opposite disk so I'm going to mirror that straight like that and then I'm going to use of course you probably know blend and then like that and uh, the last bit I'm going to do I'm going to make kind of maybe different shape of that now that's the shape yeah it must be similar similar so I'm going to make a I um, you just need to make a polar array it's gonna be three times copied like that okay and then I think that inside I need to basically cut the stuff inside and uh, that beats too okay and what we need to do right now that's we need to basically we need to have those back but we also might need to make some some blend but not uh, that simple but we need to get the like that okay and we need to get those the same uh, not so we're making blend with tangency okay it's just as you, as you see it's just creative stuff we're not going to finish that with the uh, with any details of the bicycle it's just a concept so remember we don't need to get that that precise all I would actually add in this situation too it's gonna be uh, just a just a detail to not look bad on visualizations it's gonna be like so I'm going to online using shift and tap and then I'm going to just boolean that shape by using boolean difference and now I can just do the details detail like that I love to play this this uh, uh, idea so that's why sometimes I'm going too deep in details but I shouldn't because I didn't promise that I will do okay so this is basically it uh, I'm quite I'm quite happy that you can you can get some some lights uh, you can show more details uh, but if you could actually do it and show me on my Facebook profile I will be I will be so glad if you could just show me how you work and what you've done so thanks for watching and good luck